The new Audi Q8 TFSI e combines efficiency, everyday suitability and power in a new way. The plug-in hybrid version in the Q8 family is available with 280 kW and a stop version with 340 kW. The electric range is up to 47 km in WLTP or up to 59 km in NEDC. All wrapped up in a package with a highly expressive exterior styling as well as comfort and functionality in the interior. The Q8 TFSI E therefore fits nearly between the TDI and TFSI driven models and the sporty SQ8 TFSI. With it, the Q8 family is finally complete. The plug in hybrid version of the Q8 family is made for people who do not want to compromise between sustainability, electric range, everyday suitability and driving dynamic. And its coupe-like exterior styling delights those who appreciate a very expressive design language. And also in the interior, the Q8 TFSI E largely retains the functionality and everyday suitability known from the other Q8 derivatives. For example, the lithium-ion battery with a gross capacity of 17.9 kilowatt hours is placed below the space floor, which has been raised up by nearly 30 millimeters. The trunk volume is 505 up to 1625 liters. The Q8 alone is a highlight by itself in my personal point of view, but if you ask me just to pick up one feature out that amazes me, it would be its performance. Especially the Q860 TFSI e Quattro convinced with a high standard equipment, for example the S9 exterior and the S9 Sport package comes as standard equipment with this model, but also with a lot of power. We have a system power of 340 kilowatt, which means 462 horsepower, and the 700 newton meter of torque is delivered to all four wheels because Quattro all-wheel drive is also a standard equipment. But also the Q855 TFSI E is a very convincing offer as well, so you will find this model, for example, on the founding program of the German Bafa. To summarize it up, both versions of the Q8 TFSI E convince in many points and continue the Audi electrification roadmap.